and welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan. Today, I will be talking to you all about cinnamon intake improves dyslipidemia, particularly in PCOS patients. We all know that cinnamon is a polyphenol rich spice that might be the oldest known spice in the world and in ancient Egypt, it was more valuable than gold. Now, cinnamon is used in nearly every holiday treat during the winter and fall, but there are plenty of benefits to using cinnamon all year round. Science has confirmed that many health benefits associated with cinnamon use. An umbrella meta-analysis has shown that cinnamon consumption it improves dyslipidemia and some metabolic disorders, particularly PCOS, and also improves the interleukin-6 and total antioxidant capacity. Dyslipidemia promotes atherosclerosis, a key risk factor for cardiovascular disease. The research that I'm talking about was published in Nutrition, Metabolism and Cardiovascular Diseases. The spice is beneficial for the markers of cardiometabolic health like inflammation, oxidative stress and even lipid profile. It contains iron, manganese, dietary fibre, calcium, its derivatives and other related compounds. Despite the accumulating evidence from meta-analysis on cinnamon effects on these markers, their findings are still controversial. Hence, scientists perform the current umbrella meta-analysis to actually evaluate the present evidence and provide a conclusive clarification. Findings of 11 meta-analyses revealed that cinnamon consumption could notably improve the total cholesterol, high-density lipoprotein cholesterol levels and low-density lipoprotein cholesterol levels, but not the triglycerides. The findings did not show any remarkable effect of cinnamon on the levels of malondialdehyde and C-reactive protein, but it enhanced the total antioxidant capacity in patients with PCOS as well as type 2 diabetes and interleukin-6. So the authors hence concluded that the results supported the usefulness of cinnamon intake in modulating the imbalanced lipid profiles in some of the metabolic disorders, specifically PCOS, and also improving the total antioxidant capacity and interleukin-6. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.